Good morning, guys. It's Monday morning, and we are on our morning walk. And we are going a little earlier this morning. It's a little after 7. And I saw there's the sunrise. I saw um, a post about a challenge and I cannot remember where I saw it but it was like take your dog for a walk and let them choose where you go so that's what I'm doing this morning I'm letting Wu go where she wants to go so we'll see where we end up so then I was thinking oh my goodness how long is this supposed to take you know so I'm gonna put a time limit on it. I don't know if I'll film the whole thing, video the whole thing, but I'm um, probably just gonna do 10 minutes and see where she takes me. So right now she's still sniffing everything. We're over by the cemetery. It's super peaceful. That's so pretty, the sunrise coming up. So when I would have come off my road, I probably would have went right and she went left. There must be lots of doggy smells because she's sniffing everything and stopping. And her harness has two buckles right there and I usually use the back one. And I'm using the top one. Uh oh, a friend. You got a friend this morning. Look how pretty. Do you see your friend? <laughs> Are we gonna go? No, 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 no. <laughs> She's like, mommy, come on, let me go over there and talk to my friend. Woo, you keep stopping. Okay, so we're not going in the cemetery. She passed that. That's the entrance. And she's right here. <laughs> I guess this is a stop and go walk this morning. There must be lots of smells. I still need to want to. I still want to go into the cemetery and look at some of the older headstones because I haven't done that since we moved in here. I think it's like 20 years ago. So I think the older ones are up this way and under that big oak tree. Haha, <laughs> this is funny. You guys see all the hair on the ground? There's a guy that lives 
at the end of our street and he has a German Shepherd and uh, I was driving um, to go to the store and I, I drive this way and I saw him standing on the sidewalk I guess it was right here and he was brushing his dog and I saw hair flying everywhere and I was like why is he brushing his dog on the sidewalk <laughs> doesn't want hair in his house so I guess he takes his dog for a walk and brushes it so that's funny that I saw the hair on the side right there okay let's see if she'll go in this way or if we're gonna keep going straight yep, we're going straight And then if she goes straight right here, I'm going to stop her because it goes to a, a busy road. So I might walk down a little bit, but then I'll turn her around. So then that will be the end of our Where's Wu taking me. Oh, wow. She turned down the sidewalk by the park. Maybe she smells the kids. Oh, wait, she's thinking about where she wants to go. She's like, hmm, I've never been that way. Oh, we're going to keep walking. All right. So, Wu's taking me for a walk this morning. <laughs> we're sniffing poles and going different ways than I would go so it looks like we're going over here to the park <laughs> that's the entrance to the kids park <gasps> wait what you got I hear a cicada. I heard it. Is it in the ground? Oh, we wants to go on the playground. Do you want to go down the slide? Do you want to swing? Oh, she's having a salad. She's stopping for a salad. <laughs> so I'm really disappointed. Um, coming down to this park that I've been bringing my kids to since they were two years old. Me Megan was two and she's 26. There's trash all over the ground. There's plastic and there's cans and there's Polar Pop cups on the playground where kids play. And there's trash outside. This is crazy. Okay, so she took me through the park and out the other side where I didn't want to go. <laughs> this used to be a working concession stand, but they haven't had it open for years. And the building's just sitting here. Alright, so she's taking me down to this busy road. So I'm just going to go down right over here and then I'm going to turn around. There's the sidewalk just ended back there. So we'll walk down a little further. This is the um, little league and the t-ball fields down at the end here. And they just built these soccer fields across the street. That just used to be a big field where um, Everyone just parked or like people would come out and hit golf balls or fly kites. Um, I've taken the kids there and we flew kites before. Woo, man, she's taking me in the grass. Okay, we're in the, <laughs> we're in the little league field. I guess she wanted to come smell some smells over here. Let's see. Where are we gonna go, Woo? Oh, I gotta tie my shoe. Oh, going in the dugout. 
Oh, we're going this way. <laughs> so there's woods back there. I'm not going back there. <laughs> I think uh, that's a construction companies where they park stuff. Oh, spider webs! Spider webs! Spider webs! Just walk through spider webs. Yeah, over here, look at the sunrise, isn't that pretty? So over here's um at the end they fenced it off from the road and then they put like climbing things and they put big rocks down here. And um it's really shady. I've never been down here. I usually just take the kids to the park. I'm glad there's a fence right there because she's going that way. There must be some good smells over here. All right, guys, I'm at F almost 12 minutes, uh, letting her roam around and take me for a walk. So this is where she took me to the end of the street. And um, if the fence wasn't there, she would probably take me out into the road. <laughs> So that's going to end our Where's Woo Taking Me Challenge. So if you guys get out and walk your dogs and usually go the same route, um, let your dog pick where you're going to walk. But just make sure you stay safe and don't go into any sketchy areas or by busy roads. <laughs> so thank you guys for watching. And Woo's going to have some more salad. And you guys have a great rest of the day wherever you may be. And Woo's gonna say, Woo out.